Hey everyone, so today I want to talk a little bit about the power of positive thinking and the model that I think exists in each and every one of us to help get through the day, through difficult circumstances, through life. And the positive attitude that you can express in so many ways by speaking positively, by smiling, by uh, greeting people on the street, by doing random acts of kindness, uh, whatever uh, form and shape it takes, it actually sets you yourself up for feeling much better. And the way it is happening is that imagine for a second that there is an internal state uh, that you have, and that internal state is really set or dictated by the external expression that you have. And so, for example, if you wake up and you're feeling grouchy and slouchy and, you know, something hurts and, you know, it's raining, you don't want to get out to work. What if you just woke up and looked in the mirror and smiled to yourself? So that smile that at that particular point in time may actually be a little artificial, right? You actually force uh, yourself to uh, express positiveness, right? You, you don't feel it internally just yet. Uh, the theory of neuroscience tells us that if you do that and then if you actually greet your um, significant other, right, or your kids, right, and you greet them with a smile, and you basically carry on talking positively about things, then in a short instant of time, your internal state would actually change to a positive state, and that positive state will in turn uh, tend to have you exhibit more of those positive features. And so if... Uh, you think about it, there is a positive loop between how you express yourself, positively or negatively, that affects the internal state. And then the internal state that you have, whether it's positive or negative, it affects how you express uh, yourself uh, externally. And so the point there is that you actually have a control, an indirect one, but a control over the state by just how you express yourself externally. And so if you are unhappy and if you are um, scolding somebody, right? And if you're using bad words and if you are really emotional about things, then most likely your internal state will uh, absorb this information. It will turn negative and it will actually bring you down and you will have more of those negative thoughts. And you can think of it as, um, you know, go like you pretty much going down in a spiral right like of that negative thinking at the same time uh and this has been shown over and over again in science right and by many people has been recognized that if you are forcing yourself in the beginning to be externally happy right like and forcing yourself to uh exercise and to smile and be positive then your state is going to set to positiveness and then it will help you actually in a positive spiral to go up uh, during the day. I will add just one thing to finish this topic off, uh, which is sort of interesting. I was hearing a lecture by one of the doctors and he was uh, very upbeat and basically coming across very energetic and lively. And uh, one of the things he said, which was actually very interesting to me, was that phrase that to uh, gain energy throughout the day, I am, and he was talking about himself, losing the energy. Uh, in the morning where I actually wake up and almost force myself to go jog and to exercise because over time endorphins kick in and then you're feeling uh, so much better. And so the power that you have there, the control that you have is that if you are actually forcing some of those like positive things like in your routine, then it actually helps you yourself set your state into a positive territory and then help you actually kind of go up uh, in life. And I really wish that you try that and I recommend this highly. It's a very simple thing. It helps with 
uh, a lot of issues, including uh, depression, and it helps you really get uh, through the day. I hope you're watching it, and uh, we'll have more of those videos coming up for you very soon. Thank you so much.